IAA is following guidelines from the state and not allowing fans into events this fall. Members of the Pennsylvania House of Representatives are now calling on Governor Tom Wolf to reconsider these guidelines. Dan Bartels is live at McDowell with more on what these legislatures, legislators are trying to accomplish. Dan. Well, Mike, I want you to take a listen here. That is what high school sporting events will sound like this fall with no fans in the stands. But this letter to Tom Wolf is meant to help to call for parents being allowed into the stands. But Republican state representatives also say that Governor Tom Wolf is contradicting himself with these guidelines. We could all drop our kids off at the school, not watch the game, and we could all go to the casino inside where there's less ventilation and sit, sit beside each other playing slot machines, but we can't spread ourselves out on bleachers and watch our, our kids play football. This inconsistency is causing frustration among parents. They want to watch their kids play. It's plain and simple, um, and, and we hear that. Uh, repeatedly. We have gotten requests from countless parents uh, across Pennsylvania. On behalf of these parents, Republican representatives are speaking out in a letter to Governor Tom Wolf asking that guidelines are reconsidered in order to allow spectators into PIAA sports events this fall. Governor has said repeatedly that uh, you know, these decisions, at least as far as reopening schools, should be left to the local communities. And it just makes sense that the, the ability to decide whether parents or spectators are allowed at sporting events should also be made at a local level. And if parents aren't allowed into games, there's concern that they may still try to gather. If there was some, you know, elevated point where you could see the field and all the parents are trying to watch the game from a very small area, yeah, everybody would be closer together. And Representative Brad Roy is telling parents that if they want to get into the stands this season, that they should contact Governor Tom Wolf's Erie office. Dan Bartels, Erie News Now.